Hey everybody, it's me Potty, and uh, today I'm going to be showing you how you can change your icons on Mac with a uh, program called Candy Bar. This is a really easy to use program and uh, I'm not sure if it's if it works on any other platforms for example PCs on Linux or anything like that so it might only work on Mac but yeah it's really easy to use and now I'm gonna show you how to download it um, you're just gonna go to that link here and I'm gonna put that link in the description so you just easily click on it and that's it you're just gonna scroll down uh, for that one you're just gonna click on this and it's just gonna come up with the download window and um, you can save it and then install it and once you have that you're just gonna click on um, the program icon so you're just gonna open it up and yeah candy bar is just gonna come up with all your applications you have on your Mac and uh, at the bottom you're just gonna get all your custom icons you have so the only thing you gotta do is just drag your custom icons on your default icons so it's easy right for example if I have um, Firefox here and I wanna change it to another Firefox icon that I have here you see you're just gonna click on that you're just gonna drag it over here and it changes up alright once you did that you're just gonna go to apply icons and you're gonna type in your password and click on relaunch dock otherwise it's not gonna work as you can see it's changed even though I like um, I prefer this one so I'm just gonna change it back if you don't mind uh, oops sorry that one so yeah just gonna go to apply icons you're not gonna have to enter your password again but you gotta relaunch your dock and that's it it works perfect so yeah but you can also change your system icons here for example finder, dashboard, trash, home everything is cool and you can also change your dock settings and everything like that I have a custom dock here as you can see it's not default boring stuff like that so yeah I just love that program because it's easy to use and if you have the demo version because uh, um, this one this download gives you the the demo version I guess you just gonna go up here to purchase and uh, ju you're just gonna go to unlock and uh, you have to enter this serial number here and that's it it works perfectly I have the full version of it so yeah that's about it and also if you wonder how you can make your custom icons it's really easy you're just gonna go to Photoshop or any image editing program you have you're gonna go to file new and enter 500 by 500 and the resolution should be 150 and the background contents should be transparent otherwise it's not gonna work um, so you're just gonna get these little squares here so yeah you're just gonna do whatever you want with your icon I'm just gonna type in PS for now and this one could be your icon as well so yeah you just if you want to save it you're done with the icon um, you're just gonna go to file save for web and save but um, before you click on save you're just gonna make sure that it's PNG or PNG 8 it's uh, it cannot be JPEG otherwise it's not gonna work so yeah it's just gonna go to save PS and that's it so if you want to change, I'm, I'm gonna change it for that one now um, you're just gonna go to find it there it is that I made so yeah as you can see it, uh, this is the icon I made in Photoshop like 30 seconds ago <laughs> yeah so you're just gonna go search for the um, search for the Photoshop icon it's right up there 
and you're just gonna drag it over there and as you can see it's changed up and you're gonna go to apply icons relaunch the dock and there we go it works even though it looks really ugly it works and that's about it, it it's easy right so yeah if you have any questions or difficulties uh, or even suggestions for new tutorials just leave comments in the video and like favorite or subscribe or whatever you want and yeah that's about it and also stay tuned for a new video uh, coming up in a few days uh, yeah I guess that's pretty much it and see you guys later